guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today is kind of a sad day. It's actually the last day um, for the season that I'm going to be detailing cars. It's October 19th. I have two cars lined up for today. If you can't tell, I'm just driving there right now. It is 8.15 in the morning. Um, the appointment is set for 8.30 and it says I'll get there at around 8.33. So I kind of have to hurry up, but I just wanted to film a quick intro in the car because I probably won't be filming too much when I'm actually there. I'll film me detailing the car, but that's probably about it. And then this first car is just an interior and exterior detail. And then the car after that is just an interior detail. So that's all I have for today. And then after that, I'm done. I do have one other wash, just a car wash. Um, on the, I'm not sure what date it is, but it's on Sunday, today's Thursday, so just a little bit later out, and then after that I'll be 100% done for the season. So this is the condition that the car was in when I first arrived. It's always nice to, when you open the doors on the car to see a decently clean car because then you know it's not going to take too long and you're still getting paid the same amount, so that was really nice to see. I think one of the main reasons that she scheduled a detail with me was because she said that she spilled some yogurt on the passenger side carpet so I did end up getting all of that removed and then also there was a smell from that so I didn't get all of that removed but most of it and then she was fairly happy with that so that was good. Well now I'm all done with the first car. It took around, it's, I started at maybe not 8 30 i was supposed to get i did get there at 8 30 but i couldn't find the address because google maps led me to some wrong position i don't know why just like the end of a random road it's happened a few times but it's pretty annoying but the customer wasn't too picky about it i just called them so we figured it out and i ended up arriving just like 10 minutes later at around 8 40 or 8 45 so everything was okay and then I got started and as you could see from the videos the car was already really clean now it's around 10 or sorry 11 30 and I'm just eating some Culver's I'll show you I got uh, a butter burger the double butter burger so yeah and then my next detail appointment is at 12 45 and that's about uh 20 or 25 minutes away from here so another kind of long drive this other this first detail that i had in the morning was about 30 minutes away so two long drives i'm not charging anything for them let me know if you guys think i should be but i don't know i usually don't charge traveling fees or anything like that unless it's like 40 or an hour or something like that but if it's like 30 or 35 minutes i usually don't but i'll film the next detail if i can um this first one, I thought I was going to be doing the outside, and I said I did it in her garage because you could see from the video. But I asked her if she wanted me to pull the car outside when I wanted to wash the outside. And she just said, you can just keep it inside and you can just do the interior. No outside is needed. So that was nice, and I still got paid the same amount. So that was super nice. I got paid $270 in total, uh, $250 plus a tip. So that was super nice. Um, so I'll see you guys at the next detail, which is just an interior detail. So this is the condition of this van when I first arrived. It had a ton of dog hair. He said he was disabled. So it's nice that I was able to help him out because he isn't able to clean it out himself, obviously. But it took a super long time for me to clean it out um, from 12.45 all the way until around 5 p.m. But it was just me. I didn't have any help, so... It's going to take a little longer because it's just one person, so I kind of expected that. But with all of the dog hair and all the other stuff, it did end up taking a little bit longer than I expected. But it's okay because I was able to charge a little bit more. I charged $300 altogether, and he did give me a $25 tip, which is super nice of him. Well, that's going to do it for this video. Um, a nice and quick video this time. Um, my new schedule is going to be pretty much every Friday I'll be uploading a full-length video and then every other day I'll be uploading a YouTube short in case you're interested in that. So make sure to subscribe. 
like and comment comment anything you want to see because i'll be sure i pay attention to every comment and i'll definitely upload it if i think it's a good idea and that's pretty much all i have for this video thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video on friday